the world owes to Indian mathematics. Well, without India, there wouldn't be any zero. And without zero, there wouldn't be no modern mathematics, no computers, and no digital world as we know it. India's contribution to mathematics is one of humanity's greatest legacies. Over 1,500 years ago, Aryabhata treated zero not just as a placeholder, but as a number in its own right. This single breakthrough transformed calculation forever. But Aryabhata didn't stop there. He introduced the concept of place value, worked on approximating pi, and even hinted at the idea of Earth rotating on its axis. Centuries before Europe caught on, then came Brahmagupta in the 7th century. He explained how zero works in addition and subtraction and laid down the rules for dealing with negative numbers. His insight formed the basis of modern arithmetic. Bhaskara II in the 12th century took it further. His work on algebra, trigonometry and calculus influenced scholars across the world. In fact, when these texts were later translated into Arabic and Latin, they helped ignite the mathematical revolution in the Middle East and Europe. Even the word algorithm has roots linked to India. It comes from the Persian scholar Al Khwarizmi, who was inspired by Indian number system. Today, algorithms powered computing, all made possible by India's decimal system and the invention of zero. So, what does the world owe to Indian mathematics? Quite simply, the language of modern science and technology. Every equation solved, every computer program written, every digital transaction, all of it traces back to those breakthroughs in ancient India. From Aryabhata to Bhaskara, India didn't just give us numbers, it gave us the very foundation of knowledge in the modern world.